Moog Sonic 6 synthesizer. Let's start with oscillator A. We listen to oscillator A, bypassing all of this stuff. Tune it around. Octaves. Yeah. Sawtooth wave, sine wave, well actually a triangle wave, and square or pulse wave. Same choices on oscillator B. Up an octave, up two octaves, down two octaves. Tuning. This one has a switch to keep it in concert pitch. And you have your waveform types, your sawtooth, your triangle, and your pulse wave. That's it for your actual tone oscillator. Now over here, you have your low, two low frequency oscillators. Here's how you send them into the oscillator here. So we're listening to this, uh, this low frequency oscillator controlling this oscillator through this spot here. Now this, this switch here controls between this one or this one. This one's going much slower. You have a same thing on this side. And you have one set slow, one set fast. You can balance between them. And they both can be controlled by this master fader. That's enough of that. Now, if you want to use it more like a regular synthesizer with, uh, with control of the filter and the amplifier, you have to go through here. Now, this settings your, this is a balance control between these two oscillators. So let's set that right in the middle, so we're listening to both of them. This is your source mixer. This is your VCA, your amplifier. Let's bypass the amplifier right now. Okay, so now you can hear there's that to control between the triangle wave and the sawtooth wave up here. And so that's now going in to the filter. It's bypassing this. You hit the bypass, and we're bypassing the amplifier section, which they call the articulator. And now we're going right into the filter. So you can open and close the filter. You can change the resonance. Down here, you can send what they call the contour. This is your contour, your envelope generator. It's a very simple envelope generator. It only has attack and decay. You have two modes. You have one mode where it will stay. You can hit the attack, and it will stay as long as you're holding down a key. Or you have a, a, a mode where it'll just attack and decay right away, no matter if you're holding the key or not. So that's your two choices here. You also have a choice for key, for trigger inputs for this between your keyboard or either of the two low frequency oscillators. You also have a ring modulator. There's a control for an external input and you have a, a noise generator. Pink and white noise. Selectable here. You see, this is the mode where we're, as long as I hold down the key, the envelope stays up. If I switch it to this mode, the envelope drops off right away. So there's a quick introduction to the Sonic 6. I think you'll find all the controls are working well. We've had a lot of fun putting it together. I hope you enjoy it.